Hi folks, welcome to episode 4 of our 5089 Let's Play with me, Jamie from Randomized User. And today we'll be seeing how to use the building gun to help us out as we get stronger and stronger. Now building guns allow you to build teleport beacons, ramps, storage containers, spacecraft and more. Oh, hello! <laughs> okay, so let's aim to leave our orange base area completely and do some harder quests, preferably out of range of that blasty thing, because that will kill us good. Okay, so if you've seen previous episodes, you'll know how to get to higher level weapons by buying them in higher difficulty areas, but only once you've activated the terminals. Um, who's shooting me now? <laughs> I think I might actually get inside the building at this point. Oop, deactivate. There we go. Get in the house, and we're sort of safe. No, we're not! There we go. Now we are. Phew. Right, okay, I'll stand by the um, the health terminal whilst we talk. Okay, so this is my current weapon, and um, let me just pull that up. And um, this is a level 3 energy pistol. Um, I bought this from a terminal away from the orange base. Um, realistically, this means I can go and do some quests in areas with a difficulty of around 3, but I could risk going as high as 4. Um, obviously, it's not just my gun that needs to be strong. All my essential skill points are leveled up too, around the 50 mark, um, from doing quests. Right, so now if we check the map... Um, I found a building um, over here, I reckon. I'm just put the waypoint on. Um, this, there's a quest terminal here, where the difficult and the difficulty here is level 4.1. If you look in the top left, as usual, completing these quests will be a lot tougher, but it should give us far more skill points than we're used to in one go. Around 20. Oh, and by the way, um, for the second episode in a row, the game has changed the way it generates terrain, so our map looks again different to the previous episode. Never mind. Right, so first of all, we actually have to go to the waypoint now to um, start our questing. Right, but first I think we'll actually buy the building gun here. Um, actually, I've already got one, um, but I'll just show you how to do it. Um, here's the building terminal. Um, this is the building gun right here. It's a level 2 one. Um, these, this terminal here sells level 1 and level 2 because it's in a mixed set difficulty area. I'll also need some building materials as well. You'll always need plenty of these. Um, I've already got some, but now I've got... Let's see, how many have I got? Um, 239. That may be enough, but um, I'm a big spender, so let's go for a few more. There we go. Right, I want to do it now, um, because, um, let me just pull up the, if you if you right-click it when you've got the, the gun thing going on, you can see what you can do with the gun. So yeah, you can you can build, you can build ramps and things, you can build spacecraft, teleporters and all that. We'll, we'll have a look at all these in the episode. But first I want to make a vehicle. Right, so just point it near the ground. Vum! Hello! It's the Delta Flyer! Or whatever. <laughs> oh, oh god! More like the Barry Cryer! Okay, let's go towards the waypoint, avoiding as many bastards as we can. Um, I'm paying very close attention to the detection thing. Um, but really, what I'm doing now is... Oh, 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 oh! Being as careful as I can not to attract as little attention as possible, but it's already failed because I'm crap. I'm looking at my minimap to look at purple dots. Oh, there's a purple thing. Okay, that's fine. It flew past us. Right, yep, so everything's fine so far. It looks like everyone's... Look, they're having, they're having fights amongst themselves. So we're all good. Uh, things are beaming in left, right and centre. At first I thought those things that coming from the sky were a glitch. <laughs> I thought the, the graphics card was up the spout. But no, we're all fine. So this is only a, a one-shot spacecraft. As soon as I eject by pressing space, um, the ship fucks off into another dimension. If I wanted a, a permanent spacecraft, I'd use the ones that are on those kind of trapeziums. They replenish, oh, they, they spawn on top of those every so often. Right, okay, so I'm in my new area. Let's go and find where the quest terminal is. I'm just quickly get rid of that box because it's making the place look untidy. Um, everything seems safe. There's more likely to be purple bastards in here, of course. Uh -huh. That's a consumables thing. Ooh, maybe I will get some of that. Because um, I could do with a bit of health. And also I'll flog this tat, this level 1 launcher. Uh, I'm down to 777. That is not many credits. Ooh. Oh, hello. <laughs> You're one of us. You're fine. Uh, another building terminal there. That'll sell higher level building guns. Um, which, sometimes, is useful to get a higher level one. There we go. So there's the quest terminal. Right, okay, so let's have a look at the... Let's have another look at the map. Um, we don't have a health charger here, which is a nuisance. I'd like to have one. Uh, what we'll do um, is... Activate the building gun. What we're going to do first of all, and before we go on a quest, is put down a radar. Doing. And a booster. 
Right, these two... Oh, I can hear a clinky thing. Oh, it's, it's, up. it's okay. It's, I think it's outside. Okay, so what these do, the radar means that if I look around now... Um, you see that, that kind of like grey stuff? <laughs> that tells you where a, a goodie or a baddie is. Um, a th where threats are and things like that. I think it just does it with baddies, actually. Um, uh, yeah, you can just see the grey things in the distance. There's not actually that much around us at the moment, so we're fairly safe. Look, there we go. Those, those grey things I've resolved. The orange is telling me that it's, um, it's sort of half detecting me. If that turned red, it will have detected me fully. So that's what the radar does. It gives you a lot you know, better feedback as to what's going to shoot you next. The skill point thing... Well, that's simple. It um, just increases your... When you're, when you're close to it, it increases your skill points. So my stamina was... I think it was 51 or something. My guns was 50. But standing near the, the skill points booster thing in me, Bob, uh, just temporarily increases it. As soon as I go away from this thing, um, it'll stop. So that'll help us. Okay, I'm just looking in the map again. Um, there's a lot more grey um, pointy things on the map now because of the um, the radar thing. Um, I'm starting to regret not going to this house over here because this has actually got health charger and quests. But neither building has a backup, so it's going to be a bit tricky. If we get if things get too hot, I want to be able to go back to the starting point. But I can't at the moment unless, again, I use my building gun. and, and That's not my building gun. That's my building gun. And create a teleporter, which is kind of like a, a backup station. There we go. All pointy and weird. So that does mean that at any point um, I can press escape and, ret and engage teleporter in the same way that I can also return to my backup station. The interesting thing about the teleporter though is when I teleport back to the teleporter, let's just demonstrate this. I'll go down one floor next to the building thing. So I'll engage the teleporter, which will cost me money, annoyingly. And I think um, the closer you are to the teleporter, the, the cheaper it is. So just wait for it. And here we are. We're back at the teleporter, um, which is all very well. But the good thing is, I can also go back again in, in a one-shot deal. If I go up to it and press E, I zap directly back to here, which is all very useful. You can only have one teleporter beacon on a map at any one time. If I try to build another one, that one will vanish. Okay, so using all this stuff that we've now assembled, let's go on a quest. Right. And what I want to do is find a... A protection one, preferably. Yeah, here we go. Um, I'll create, um, get a rogue probe, and then I'll protect Nathan. The reason why I want to do this one is I can get to demonstrate more of my building stuff. Uh, okay, so first of all, rogue... Oh, I need to actually select the damn thing, don't I? <laughs> Except... There we go. So, go get a rogue probe, and I can't kill anyone else whilst I'm doing this, because of the red thing in the top left. Um, that's my additional condition. So... First things first, I, I kind of want to uh, build a spaceship so I can actually fly through these things. Uh, my piloting skill is 17.6. I might be too far away, though, from my starting area um, to be able to fly this. Um, let's, um, I'm trying to do this where I'm not going to get shot. Oh, there's a little ramp there. Right, that's good. Um, this is something else that the, um, the building gun can, can do. Um, I did actually, t I was actually testing this out earlier, and I forgot to remove this. <laughs> yeah, now you can see how, how the sausages are made. Right, so am I, am I doing the right thing here? Vehicle, boom. Oh, it actually does make a nice little launching pad. Oh yes, it's okay, I have got enough skill, um, piloting skill points. And because this area um, often means that your spaceship, you need about, kind of like, skill points about... 16, 17, but I think my my booster thing that I built has actually helped me out. Um, anyway, whatever. So, yep, just flying in to get the rope probe. I don't know if I can actually collect it whilst in the spaceship, but I think we'll find out now. I seem to remember some spaceships can actually shoot, but obviously not this one. Right, come on, come on, lad. Oh! Fick. <laughs> I crashed the ship. Right, now I've got to go and protect a droid. Uh, right, I'm going to use turrets for this, hopefully, if I can actually get there without dying. Um, yep. So I could use my teleporter gun again. Oh, not my teleporter gun, my, my building gun again to build another spaceship. But there's no point because there's one right here. Hup, there we go. Right, where's my quest in me poos? If, if my protecto guy is right in the middle of these, I'm basically fucked. Thankfully not. Uh-oh. Uh, time rip. Oh, that's a problem. If you time rip in a spaceship... Oh, that's fine. Everything's fine. Right, okay. A, a, a horrible feeling the spaceship also um, gets frozen. Okay, so he's my qu This is going to be impossible. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go to here, report unreachable target. Um, this is a bit of a cheat, um, because I've basically made it so that the, um, uh, it's changed who the quest target is. 
Um, because this this area is way too hot. In fact, give us a second. <laughs> I'm just going to hide in here for a second. Right, just so I can explain that. Yeah, if um, if you get if you've got a quest where the target, someone you've got to kill or talk to, is unreachable, like he's stuck down a hole, or he's in an area which is just basically impossible to do anything with, then you can just press Q and press unreachable target, and the game will move the target and and you. Basically, it kind of like resets the quest, um, gives you more of a chance of doing it. You can use that to your advantage somewhat. Like, um, if it was, if um, if your matey boy was, uh, like there, surrounded by absolute evil bastards, it's a good, kind of like it's a bit of a cheat, I guess. Um, but it's it helps us for the sake of the video, because otherwise I would immediately fail that quest. Uh, right. So yeah, I need I need time to use my um turreting skills, um, which will take a bit of time to set up. Let's get up my building. Whilst I'm actually on the move, I shall choose turret. And that looks like him. That looks like my pal. So we'll de hoverboard. Hong. Right. Now, oh god, there's already a matey boy. Hang on. Oh shit, I think I might have shot my, the guy I'm supposed to be protecting. But <laughs> shit. In fact, quick, there we go. I'm going to time rip. Um, it's just so I can make damn sure he dies. Oh, yeah, there we go. Right, building gun. Right. Yep. Insufficient building parts? Oh, bloody hell, I've run out already. Um, okay, hang on, let me just um, return to teleporter. Uh, hopefully I won't... Bollocks! <laughs> that thing exploded on my quest target. Oh, you little fuck. Right. <laughs> I'll have to try that again. Right, I've got another protection quest on the go. So let's see how this one goes. I've got loads more building materials now as well. Oh, this is a bit more like it. So... Put a turret there, put a turret there, and put a turret there. Right, so there's are like the, the common garden turrets that tend to appear in houses and things. And they're going to help us out as we protect our matey boy. First of all, get the spaceship. Die. Oh no, my... Oh, there we go. Fine. Um, now, him. All the turrets are really having a go at Ava, which is good to see. However, Ava is more concentrated on killing my guy. Oh, it's all good. It's all good. Everything's fine. Uh oh, there's a spirit. Um... Fucking things, I hate these things so much. Uh, where is it? I don't think I don't think spirits can actually attack um, my my other robots. I think it's... Oh, shit. Hang on. Oh, no. Time rip. Um, okay. Try and get him. A bit of Kendall mint cake action there. Oh, there's so many. Um, I can't time rip either. Oh, dear. Hang on. Let's put more turrets. Oh, hang on. Oh, no. There. Loads of turrets. Oh, I can't see a thing. Oh, this is all going spectacularly wrong. Um, I might not be convincing you as to the effective effectiveness of these turrets. Oh, and these spirits are everywhere. There's about three of them on me. Oh, my, my bloody target has died. Oh, <laughs> this just got too hot too quickly. I mean, there were just so many enemies. Um, hang on. Right, time rip and escape. <sighs> there are so many enemies out there. Um, I think we'll, we will go on another quest here. I was, th I was thinking of moving uh, to an easier area, but let's not give up so easily. My level 3 energy pistol, maybe, maybe it's a time, maybe it's time I upgraded that. Uh, let's see, this is, um, there we go, look, level 4 energy pistol. That'll do damage per second of 73 as opposed to 60, which is better. I'm not sure if I've got enough money though, so this might be a big mistake. Not enough credits. How many do I need for that? The oh my god, millions! Okay, I've um, sold as much as I can, um, including my hoverboard, but that should, should just be enough to get us the gun. Um, that one, oh, the one on the right is much better than the one on the left, but the one on the left is all we can afford at the moment. So we'll have to do that, but at least it's a level 4 thing. Um, I'm down to 43 credits. Right, so before we go on this quest, it might be sensible for me to use my building gun to make some storage. There we go, nice little box. Now I've got a little storage thing. I'm going to put all my stupid conversion um, things in there, which I keep on getting as a result of doing quests. We're going to try converting bases. I think hopefully the next episode, actually, because that's an important part of the game. But it is quite later on in the game. Um, you can't really do it at the start in any way, shape or form. But look at my inventory. It's almost gone. Right, so I've got a better gun. Um, not much better gun, but a better gun. And we can now hopefully go on a quest to get some skill points. Um, I don't really fancy my chances any on any of these quests. I don't have any time rips, so I can't do a, a gun. Play. Try that one. That one's a very simple one. Um, getting combined parts of an artifact. Right. Okay, so my um, skill points are being boosted. Uh, 
Can I create a spaceship, maybe? The, the target of my quest is, oh my god, right over there. Okay, let's try and build a vehicle. Uh -huh. Oh god, there's no space. Uh, uh, hang on, the valleys. The radar works out here as well. There we go, right. Circuitous route, I think. Oh, there are purple buggers everywhere. I'm just going to go high, as high as I can. Fly past! Whee! There we go. Obligatory Top Gun reference! <laughs> right, let's go. Let's try and duck under his radar. Oh, the quest target is... Oh, no, it's under him. Right, okay, I've got to be very careful here. Um, because if that, that thing could blast me at any moment. Oh, aim! This, this gun can't aim. Aim! There we go. By the looks of it, it's a stronger gun, though, so that's all good. That wasn't even the target... Oh, I see. Sorry, I'm going mad. That is what I need to get. There we go. I have got both parts of an artifact. Um, what's shooting me? Oh, you are. Okay, hang on. Try and... Oh, yeah, this gun's much more powerful. I'm actually blasting through things now. I'll take you back. The damage per second thing was a bit deceptive. I'm literally just shooting random people now. What I want to do is get all these things and then sell them for cash, because I am down to 42 credits. Right, I need a workstation. Um, in order to put those two bits of artifact together, I need a workstation. That one there is, looks okay, but it's absolutely surrounded by people. Uh, it looks like it's the only place I can actually go to. So, waypoint goes over there. And all these are baddies in the way. Oh, God. On the upside, let me get some more building materials, which will allow me to build... Oh, is that it? Blimey. Which will allow, allow me to build a quick... Um, hang on. Another vehicle. Um, I'll have to do this, again do this really quickly. Turbo build! Oh, no, wrong button. Oh, there we go. Right. Doing up and over. Right, that's where I need to get to. So I think I'll try and circuit to it as rooted again. Oh, I mean shot. Ah, uh, ah, uh, serpentine! Uh, up, 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 up. Nope, that's not helping. Oh, I could do with a grappling gun right now. And... Uh, doing! Last second. <laughs> oh, this thing's full of baddies. Oh, uh, nope. I'll just sod him. Sod him. Just gonna get to the workstation. Where's the work? Where's the workstation? Workstation's upstairs. Right. You can see all those horrible yellow things telling me where things are. There's a lot. Oh, nope. upstairs again. Upstairs. Do 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 do. There he is. There's the workstation. Right. Combine those two things. And there we go. Now this quest is this this final part of the quest is going to be really tough, <laughs> because. Uh, I need to give give the um, artifact to someone, which is normally very easy. However, I can't be detected by an enemy at any point. This is going to be a dick. Oh, hello, mate. <laughs> and apparently... Oh, no, my quest target is on top of that. I might be able to build a ramp. I might just have enough building materials to build a ramp. Um, that might be speculative at best. Um, let's have a go, though. Right. Where's the quest... I think it's... In th I can see him. He's on top of that thing. So, we're going to use our building gun one last time. This might prove a bit beyond me, I'm afraid. Um, what's going on? Everything's shooting. Right, so, first of all, I'm going to build a little rampette. Um, this, this is how you do it. Um, I won't go into full details here, but um, left-click changes the mode. Um, so I need to do that. Stretch it out a bit. Make it smaller. And also make it a bit rampier. And then I can press E and left click, and I've got a little ramp. Um, I think. It's still it's flashing a bit, but um, have I finished doing it? Yeah, there we go. Right, so now I can see what I'm doing. Now he's he's my quest target. So I'm going to use that ramp technique again. Um, put down the two nodes. Uh, left click, make it, re make it really flat first so I don't use up all my building materials. Um, and this... <laughs> This, I'm just building a really, really, really long ramp. Um, I also need to make it flat. There we go. Which means I can walk up to him and everything should be fine. Uh, how many's? Oh, it costs 326. Um, okay. Um, I've only got 27. So this might prove to be a bit... Um, <laughs> yeah, hang on. Okay, I've got a few more building materials. Um, so, do that. That looks like it's about in place. Current build. Yep, that's it. I can do it. I've got enough. E, left click. A dynamic object is too close. Oh, there we go. That's fine. 
So now I've got a ramp. I can't go through here, um, sadly. So I'll have to actually go out the roof um, and jump on. Um, all I need to do is deliver something without being detected. So this should be straightforward. If I just stealth my way across here, not looking left or right, well, actually, maybe, <laughs> maybe quickly. Uh, oh, hang on. Getting slightly stuck there. Keep on trucking. Come on. Uh, uh, oh, look, the, um, the ant has gone for a spin. Poor little guy. Live! No. Right. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, I mean, very, have, have to be very stealthy. If anyone... Oh, shit. <laughs> Didn't quite go far enough. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> shit. Shit, I was so close. Okay, hang on. I'm still stealthy. I've still got stealth enabled. Oh, look at that. <laughs> uh, I'll have to go back up to the top. Hang on. This is actually looking a little more dangerous this time. And there are purple things flying. Uh, I still haven't quite resolved how I'm going to jump that final gap. Uh, oh my god, there's three of them! Oh, I'm so exposed! Okay, maybe if I get to the very end. Um, or... Yeah, okay, I'll go to the very end, right. And jump! Mm. Yes! Oh, thank fuck for that. <laughs> and... Done it! Unbelievably, finally! Managed to do an actual quest. 11 delicious skills. Right. Um, stealth is 13.9. I think it's still been affected by that skill booster in my house, which is all very nice. Uh, let's increase guns, I think. Guns, maybe a bit of stealth. Some piloting. And defense. <sighs> right, so, cool. Okay, so we are now moving successfully into higher skill level areas, which is all very nice. Uh, where's my, um, where's my box gone? My ramp's just died. Oh, no, it's not, because you can... <laughs> It is still there. It's just so thin, you can barely see it. Excellent. <laughs> right, okay, so we'll stop here. Um, I think I'm going to need to go and push on a bit, actually. Um, and I need to find a, um, a backup terminal that's a bit further out, um, somewhere around here. Oh, we also need to go to deal with an X quest very soon. Thank... No, there's one. Maybe we'll go over there, because that's got a backup station, but precious little else, admittedly. But we'll save that till next time, anyway. God, there are so many enemies around. Okay, so thanks for watching, subscribe for future episodes in this series, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.